We are in Miami. We drove for five hours today and finally arrived here. Um, we are in this very fancy hotel room, not too far away from um, Miami Beach, uh, which we wanted to go swimming and it started raining after like 20 minutes in the water and these streets of Miami are not designed to sustain such heavy rain because it's basically the apocalypse there. <laughs> Nicolas and his mom uh, went to go grocery shopping while I uh, had a hot shower and a tea, which I really needed because there is air conditioning everywhere and being wet with air conditioning is not a good idea. You can probably hear my voice uh, cracking up a bit. Uh, it's because I'm, I'm starting having a throat throat. Um, tomorrow we're going to keep exploring uh, Miami. See you tomorrow. This is the end of the second day of Miami. We started the day by going into a street art um, museum. to change every now and then so what we saw today might not be what you see if you go there after that we went to visit uh, Little Havana uh, which is basically one street and the eighth street in Miami uh, where you have a lot of Cuban restaurants and things with cigar and a lot of music uh, which was very nice and we ended up eating uh, on the pier at Boba Gump, where I got um, my cocktail in a camping mug in metal that says run for us, run, uh, which I thought was funny. After eating, we ended the day by going into a beach, which is inside a national park. a lot in the beach. I had to remove uh, cups and plastic things uh, on the beach and they had some non-raccoon proof uh, garbage bins that were left open so we saw actually three raccoons having a fist inside it and no one seemed to care. Uh, which what we remember back in Shenandoah and other national park in the west coast um, was a lot more controlled. You didn't have wildlife eating inside garbage at all because they had to be moved away uh, if that happened. So we were kind of surprised uh, that this happened here, but I don't know, maybe it's because we're so close to Miami, uh, it's kind of different here. 
And we finally ended the day by going into the spa of our hotel room, watching the sunset. We thought it was going to rain again, because it rained a lot yesterday, but it didn't. Uh, so we had the chance to watch the sunset and uh, relax. I actually uh, slept on the class and now he's sleeping, so I'm not gonna be uh, very long. I hope you like this vlog. Subscribe if you want to see more. We are going into the Keys tomorrow, uh, where we're gonna watch the sunset and do dives in two, maybe four different locations. So stay tuned for that and we hope to see you next time.